We're in our basic PowerShell series, and I want to show you another trick that I have for getting to PowerShell more quickly or switching back to command prompt using the start menu. So let's go ahead and close PowerShell. And if we right click on the start menu, we see PowerShell admin and we see PowerShell. But what if we want to see command line or what if the command line's here and we want to see PowerShell? Well, it's pretty easy to switch back and forth in the start menu, which one you want. So if I go down to the taskbar, right click and I choose taskbar settings. Then a new menu pops up, and here I can make a change. Let's go ahead and expand this and we'll click on taskbar on the left hand side. Make sure it's highlighted there. And we'll take a look. It says replace command prompt with PowerShell in the menu when I right click on the start button. So we can turn that off if we like. We go back down to the start button, and we see it now says command prompt and command prompt admin. If we turn that back on again, we go back to the start button, right click, and now we see PowerShell. So depending on which one you want, you can switch back and forth between that when you right click on the start button. Now this works in Windows 10, Windows Server 2016, 2019. And what's interesting is when you right click in the Windows 10 option, it defaults to a different one than the Windows Server option. But it doesn't matter. In both of them, you can switch back and forth to the one that you want. I prefer to have PowerShell because it is a more useful utility, and it also includes many of the different commands that I'm used to in Command Prompt. So I can go ahead and choose that. When we're all done, we can go ahead and close the taskbar option, and we can get right back into PowerShell by right-clicking.